Hey guys, it's Godzilla Zachary, and welcome back to another video. And you might be thinking, why are we focusing on the office clocks? Well, here's what's going on. It is December 26th, and today we are going to be doing something that is regarding in between these two clocks. I wonder which one it is. Well, the answer is this one. The Wentworth 31 day wall clock. And what are we going to do with it exactly? We are going to be winding this clock today as it actually he needs wound. Wow. Oh, and I haven't wound it in it since I got back from Thanksgiving break. So let's go ahead and do that. As you see, like it is very beautiful. I just love the hands. The gong. The pendulum, and let's see. So here's the key. It's, it's kind of a basic, but it is is a nice one. And as we see, that's right. It winds in both ways on the right. I'm not doing the other one because I'm not sure or if I can because of how how hard this one is to wind. But anyways, let's get into winding the Wentworth. And that's a bit of a spring slippage. Hey, okay, that's that side. Now let's do the other one. I can hear more spring slippages. All right, there we go. The clock is now fully wound and it's gonna be good to go for another month. <laughs> but there we go. That's me, me winding my Wentworth 31 day wall clock. And I'm glad it still works perfectly. It does have some spring slippages. I may need to get some oil for it. It, but other than that, it's pretty nice. And Godzilla is still living on top. But anyways, guys, hope you enjoyed this video. Oh, I know it was a bit of a short one because we were winding a clock. But it was fun to do. Hope you guys enjoy. If you did, be sure to leave a like. Don't forget to subscribe and ring the bell to be notified. And once again, happy holidays to all of you. I'll see you guys in the next one. So long!